it's Holly and welcome to the proper pineapple today I have a fun video for you it's actually gonna be like a two-part so I'll the beginning and you'll see you'll see anyways I got an email from this company called I believe Babylon I don't know if that is correct you guys I will obviously the name is in the title I'm sorry if I said it wrong <laughs> I'm not so good with the names they are a wonderful company that manufactures t-shirt yarn which I have never worked with but I always wanted to they have a huge supply on Amazon um, they make a lot of kits and stuff and it was really really cool don't worry their link is down below first link in this video um, and they contacted me asked me if they could send me one of their constructor kits and I was like sure why not so they sent me this it is their donut and they sent it to me in the flamingo colors because I love flamingos, right? So I'm thinking it's this pink one, but maybe it's this turquoise with the pink bottom. I don't remember. If you hear the dog, she's bad. I'm sorry. <laughs> so, and the reason, so, okay. First off, they're a wonderful company. They have lo tons of videos. So actually the second link will be to their YouTube channel. Lots of tutorials. You'll love them. Um, their yarn is eco-friendly cotton. It's beautiful. I'm super excited to open this up. The reason they call this their constructor kit is it's not just a kit, not just like you got your yarn. No, this comes with, it says it right here on the side, I'm going to read it to you. Two cotton yarn balls in different colors, 35 colorful yarn pieces for decoration. See how the donuts have sprinkles? They gave you the sprinkles even. 5.5 um, yards of yarn for stitching together. See on the, you can see in the donut here, it like stitches together. So that. They gave you one metal crochet hook, so they even throw in the hook, um, a plastic needle for sewing in your ends, a stitch marker, 100 grams of stuffing, silicone stuffing, and an activity book, and um, you get a PDF with the detailed instructions included in your kit. I'm super excited. I don't normally do kits, but I have been wanting to, you know, maybe try out this whole t-shirt yarn bandwagon and see if I like it so this is perfect for me this kit is designed for all skill levels it's supposed to be super easy for everybody to do not just like you know experienced but even newbies should be able to make this donut but they all like I said they have these um purse kits that I want to get one has like glitter they have so many things I want to get y'all but anyways follow their link down below you have to go check it out it's amazing so I have not opened this I just just this I have not opened it. There is a sticker on the sides here. And I don't think I have a knife. So let's see if I can just peel this sticker off, y'all. Because I don't have a knife. <laughs> I don't have anything to cut this with. I wasn't thinking before I started this video. If you hear noise or the room starts shaking, it's not an earthquake. My husband's coming in. Cut that edge for me. I don't do well with knives. So he's doing. Thank you, Mr. Pineapple. <laughs> okay, guys, so we're going to do it just like I do all my openings. I'm going to hold it up nice and high so you guys can see before me even because all I see is the back of this box. This is what it looks like in the inside. Oh, my goodness. Doesn't this go with my house? <laughs> look, look, okay. So pink and then look, you can't see my curtains. Let me put tear guys. Oh, my gosh. It totally goes with my house. I'm going to love this. All right. I'm going to set it down now and show you guys everything individually. So, the first thing on the top. What, Mr. Pineapple? I said those are cute skeins. Aren't they cute as a so button? The way they're rolled up. That's I don't even want to use them. They're too cute. Anyways, okay. First thing on the top is this beautiful activity book that tells you everything. It's, it's all in there, you guys. It's all the stuff. I'm not going to show you the pattern because it's not my pattern to show y'all, but... So cute. Oh, look at the back, guys. Look, there's some more stuff on there. See, they do purses and pillows. And, ooh. Ooh. Oh, this purse here. Let me see if you could see. Can you see this one with the glitter? I want to make that one, but I kind of want to make this backpack style too and maybe slippers. Oh, no, you guys. Did I find something I, I have to shop for now? Okay, so this adorable little bag of stuffing. We've got a little, like, uh, burlap ribbon on it so cute here is the cream colored yarn let's see if I can cover my face so you can see a little better the cream color to stitch it all together look they put a little bow on it 
Here are my sprinkles, you guys. Look at all these colors. There's orange, uh, two different pinks, a yellow, red, purple, blue, and lime green. Oh my gosh. My donut's gonna have sprinkles. Sprinkles, sprinkles, sprinkles. They sent a wonderful 5.5. Oh, no, I'm sorry, 8 millimeter crochet hook, which is good because I don't think I have an 8 in the hooks I use, so I think I'm going to have to use this one, so I'm glad they sent it. Then in this little baggie down here, your little darning needle and a stitch marker, which you all know I have too many stitch markers, and now let's talk about these yarn cakes. Oh, my goodness. Look at this turquoise one. Look at that. Isn't that the most beautiful yarn cake you've ever seen? Aside from this stunning pink one, look at these. It's like a yarn vortex. Like you could get sucked into this. I would. I would totally dive into that vortex. <laughs> so cool. Okay. So initial thoughts here as I'm doing this. Um, the yarn cake feels very stiff. Very like you can't squish it. But I'm not, I don't think like the yarn feels smooth. So I don't think that's like a problem i think that's just it's wrapped so tightly and done so well i think that's amazing like you could stack these just for decoration i just want to put this like somewhere for a decoration in my house but i told them that i would make a donut and review it here for you guys so this is the first part of the video and now i am going to shut the camera off sit down make a donut and i will be back here in like two seconds it'd be like seamless for you guys but for me who knows how long it's gonna take me to make a donut because seriously i might cry if i have to take these apart look at how pretty these are <laughs> i don't want to take them apart and they're my colors and i think if you guys saw let's see okay so it's this one down here they have the turquoise on the top but come on guys it's me i think the pink has to be on the top don't you i think my donut has to be done like this this is the donut I would purchase and buy. Right? Right. All right, guys. So I'm going to get making a donut. Like I said, here in two seconds, it's going to just be boop, donuts done. Boom, done. Isn't it adorable? <laughs> okay, so what I love about this is that they gave me enough sprinkles to do both the pink side and the turquoise side so that way I can have whichever side I want. It's so cute. Mine is not as perfectly round as theirs. But I think that's from my stuffing, not from them. Uh, I absolutely love this. This is so, so cute. My kids have been fighting over who gets this. But I happen to have finished this on my son's birthday, so he gets it. And I know what you're saying. It's pink. He doesn't really care. He just wants to lay on it because it's tiny. So I'm loving it so, 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 so much. Um, a couple things. This kit was awesome. It gave you everything. They gave you the needle you needed. They gave you all the yarn you would need. All the sprinkle yarn. And they did give a white yarn for... A uh, white t-shirt yarn for sewing it together. But as you can see, I did not use it. I'll talk about that in a minute. But um, everything. Stuffing. Everything. Well, I knew as soon as I saw this that... I didn't like the white yarn. I mean, it's a personal preference. I think it's cute. But for me, I wanted it to be done with the pink. So I just made sure I saved enough yarn to do the pink binding around both the inner and outer. And it was perfectly fine. Now, again, one slight change to it I did was I like my Ami, Groomy, or whatever you want to call it, really kind of firm. So I stuffed the tar out of this and I actually ended up needing a little bit of my own personal stuffing I had but that is just because I like mine so firm <laughs> that I use but they gave plenty like if you would have just stuffed this so it was a nice soft pillow would have been perfect but I stuffed it so it's like a hard rock pillow but that's what we like around this house so that's what I did um it was so much fun to make I will say for me because I am not adept I guess at crocheting with really thick yarns it, it kind of hurt my hands for a while because I was using this big thick yarn and I have been using really thin 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 yarn for a long time now so it kind of took me a minute to get into it but if you already use really thick yarn I think this would be great for you I think this would be great for children to learn to crochet oh my gosh it would be wonderful the instructions super simple super easy it gave the kit itself gave you everything you needed there was nothing else needed the kit had it all in it so it's perfect you just go buy the kit give it to the kid and help them read the instructions and then they'll get it they'll learn to crochet and look at this cute donut. look at the sprinkles guys get it up there 
see. Oh, kind of changed the color because it's pink. Let's flip it to blue. Look at how cute. And you get to just, there we go. Adjusted color on itself. <laughs> I love it so much. I would use the pink side because, you know, I love pink. But my son's probably going to use the blue side. But either way, look at the donut. Isn't it adorable? I love it. So they have tons of kits. Tons of kits. Even this donut kit comes in a couple different colors. And tons of like purse kits and other project kits on their Amazon page. Also, they have just spools of yarn, which if you guys saw when I did the unboxing just a few seconds ago for you guys, their spools are amazing looking. So there is a link down below to their Amazon shop. And just above that link is a coupon code, which I will put here at the bottom of the screen, that is good for 30 days from the time this video comes out. So for, I believe, 10% off your purchases. So please go over there, check it out. If you've been wanting to try t-shirt yarn, I definitely recommend them. I absolutely loved this and thought it was great. So, so much fun. Like I said, the kids have been fighting over it. I might have to buy a couple more kits and make a couple more donuts because one donut, three kids, do the math, you guys. Okay, guys, I'm gonna get out of here. Like I said, link down below. Please use this coupon code. Love you guys, and I hope you guys go and check them out and give them some love too because I absolutely adore doing this. Bye.